Watch this video. Oh, that was a plan. We are now All right, we're watching another Mr. Beast video. Seven days stranded at sea. Stranded on a raft in the middle of the ocean. And there goes our boat. We are now stranded for seven days. How much longer? Seven days. Frick. This raft is literally countless miles from the nearest civilization. Jesus. Now, whether we like it or not, my four friends and I are stuck on this raft. And it's not going to be easy. This is brutal. <laughs> We're all at rock bottom now. This challenge went from fun to a literal nightmare very fast. Oh, hell no. Nah. Bro, look how far away the boat is. I can't even see it anymore. So step one, uh -huh. we're gonna get sunburned if we don't get shade. And I had survival specialists equip this raft with tons of wood, rope, and everything else we would need to build ourselves a shelter. Boys, we need to get started. We are running out of light. I got this side. Oh, my finger. Now we set these up like a TP. We picked the worst day to start. As you can tell by the clouds, it's literally about the storm. Damn. So first thing we want to do is set up some structure to cover us. Also, since we're on this slab of wood for the next seven days, we need a place to hide from the sun so we don't get sunburned. So two birds, one stone. Speaking of birds, while we were building, this happened. Bro, the bird! It's coming Yo. right at us. Oh my god. Yo. Oh my god, it's a bird. Yo. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, that's actually kind of dope. Crazy. We should name him. What's his name? Brian. 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 What if you went and caught some fish? I know. He's looking at me. He understands. Jimmy, just say the word. Put the knife away. OK, I'll put the knife away. <laughs> and the hatchet. Brian, that was a joke. Forget the bird. We got to build We're a shelter. And Is that fucking laser beam? <laughs> Brian watched, we worked on our first shelter for the rest of the day. Except hey, Brian said he needs some fucking rage on the kick and phase. Yeah, you didn't see that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We already talked about that beginning of the stream. Um, but this nigga, this nigga, bro, he didn't, he didn't really fuck with y'all for real. He just needed some space. He needed like, you know what I'm saying? He needed to rest his wings a little bit. And y'all gave him that. Y'all, yeah, you know what I'm saying? He appreciates you. But he's not, you know what I'm saying? He's not about to fish for y'all. Except for my friend Tariq, who spent the entire day getting cool drone shots. And I'm not even mad about it. Inside this crate is the food for all five of us for the next seven days. All right. Oh, oh my God. Damn. And in these two barrels is our entire water supply for all five of us. How does it taste? Like water. Very hot. <laughs> oh, no. Sure. There was dirt in my cup. It's getting dark, and that crate has the word sleep on it. Hopefully, the survival guides gave us something soft. Why are they wet? They can still get wet on a boat. Yeah. I'm ready for bed. I want to go to sleep. All right, this is night one, and Brian is just yawning. <laughs> this is miserable. This is all the coverage we have. I didn't realize what I was signing up for. It's hot. This thing will not stop swaying, and I feel like I'm going to puke. And I'm surrounded by a bunch of sweaty people. Hey, sweaty men. <laughs> if you guys smell this bad on day one, what are you going to smell like on day seven? Damn. Oh, gosh. Right, why did Laser? Well, Laser, why did you agree to this? You didn't have to do that. <laughs> Our first night of sleep was really rough. Sleeping is impossible. These waves are just making me miserable. And to make matters worse, our best friend Brian ended up leaving us that Damn. morning. Brian, Brian said, "I right, y'all, I'm out. Brian, Brian said, y'all be good. <laughs> but regardless, today's objective is to build ourselves a permanent weatherproof shelter. How do we turn that into a livable structure? There's definitely something here. Luckily, I had them throw a bunch of wood on the raft so we could build a nice house. How we build the house, I'm not quite sure. But they said this is enough to build a house. But ironically, right as we got started. Oh, it started it's raining. raining. Damn. Jimmy, get my shark pillows. Whoa. Whoa. This is miserable. He's just throwing shit. Ah, Jesus Christ, you're not doing the right thing, Nolan. Listen with your ear. Why do you yell so much? Because you don't oh, listen. I'm gonna hit Nolan. It's just rain. Shut up. <laughs> At least we don't have to shower. Yeah. This is so bad. We still have over six days left. Oh, hell no. Where do we go poop? They about to laugh oh, themselves into pain. Pooper. What? We have to build everything that's here. We have to build the toilet, build our... Oh. Y'all can't just... Hey, honestly, I'm going to be honest. Fuck all that building the toilet shit. I'm going to hang my ass... <laughs> I'm going to hang my ass over the raft and go crazy. Fuck is you talking about? Hey, somebody hold my hand. Make sure I don't fall over. I'm pooping right into the fucking water. Ass over edge. Fuck is you talking about? Hell no. Hell no. Shelter, the fire, everything. 
The moment the rain finished, the boys and I needed to build all of our survival essentials, starting with the shelter. We're tearing this down in the name of something better. Five minute break for Chris. I also need a break. I'm seasick. I, I'm, I'm out of it. I'm... You gotta pick this up. I can't. I can't pick it up anymore. I feel like you're doing all the work, but we got two other goofs just laying down. I'm miserable. We built one wall. Yeah, we built one wall. All together. All of us. Regardless of being seasick, it was going to take all of us if we wanted to finish this. Now you guys bring it forward. There. Yeah, there. Yeah, OK, they got us as a little How free. How many YouTubers does it take to build a little look? structure? What? Did we Is that freaking a out? wild? I think that's a whale. That's insane. Sick. Oh my god. That is awesome. That's crazy. Two whales. This experience just keeps getting better. Shelter, water, not being near Nolan. I'm never going to take that for granted again. Probably would have been really useful to build the ladder first. We got a ladder now. I literally just built this four minutes ago. After hours of building, we were finally getting somewhere. Mm, okay. I severely regret making this a seven day challenge instead of a 50 hour challenge like all our other videos. We keep rocking back and forth. It's freaking miserable. I'm going to puke. And finally, just as the sun was going down, camp is now organized. Yay! 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 Night two, my bed is still broken, but I'm going to get some sleep tonight because I'm that tired. I'm going to head to bed. Oh, did I wake you up? Uh, just go back to bed. Uh, I'm just walking. I actually will play up. I feel bad now. This might be the most tired I've ever been in my entire life. Jesus. On another note, though, why is Chris so good at construction? I don't know. Hey, Chris was building out that motherfucker. Hate on them all you want. Hate, hate on, hate on them. Hate on them all you want. Chris was building that shit. You know what I'm saying? You gotta respect that. You gotta respect that. It's now day three, and somehow our building didn't fall over. I'll take that as a dub. Noises that this structure made while I was sleeping last night filled me with nightmares. It's day three, and we've really started to get into a rhythm. Our morning routine consisted of peeing in the corner. Bro, who vlogs in the pee corner? I'm not moving. Eating our breakfast. Surviving on feastables. What's all you need? <laughs> and drinking hot barrel water. So dehydrated. I need this. We're about 36 hours in, and we're almost halfway through a barrel of water. Is that slow or fast? We're going to run out on day six. Running low on water and food gave me an idea. I'm kind of curious to see what's under the boat. Dude, there's so many fish below us. So we decided to try to catch some dinner, but we weren't very good at it. Why does this take so long? Not I just want something to put in my stomach. Brian! Brian, help us catch fish! Brian! Brian! Turns out fishing is a lot harder than YouTube. After hours, we caught absolutely nothing. Why Damn. can't we catch anything? Uh, like and they're all we were tired. What's crazy is they caught no fish, and all the motherfuckers is really right there at the bottom, just chilling. Waiting to be caught. Nah. Now let me go home for real. I'd rather be on a job. Oh, God. Boy, I don't play with nobody's water like that unless I'm on a big old cruise ship, bro. I'd rather try to survive seven days in the jungle than try to survive seven days on, on a raft. You're dehydrated crazy? and hungry, which forced us to dig into our rations. Let's have ourselves a feast. Yeah! yeah. We'll call it a feast. A bowl. Uh, hey. uh, in our supplies, we had wood to build a fire and pans to cook with. You take big stick and make really little sticks. And then make medium sticks. Then use the big sticks at the end. Hey! Hate on them all you want. Chris is putting in that fucking work. You, hate on them all you want. Chris is putting in that fucking work. Chris is cooking. I ain't gonna lie. This nigga is cooking, bro. <laughs> nigga got all. Nigga got it. Chris is carrying. Look at him. Beans, 
baby. I am so excited. This looks awesome. This is a really bad. Can you tell we've been at sea for three days? Literally. When have I ever been this excited over canned chili? Hey, I put some love into this one. It's not just canned chili anymore. It's got tomatoes, kidney beans. You don't have to keep talking. I'm already drooling. This was our first hot meal in days, but it was also a good chunk of our rations, so we made sure to enjoy it. I'm feeling a lot better. I think the first two days were definitely the most miserable. I think we're slowly like losing our minds, and it's actually becoming bearable. I still haven't gone to the bathroom. That's my biggest concern now. Yeah. Oh, he has it shitted. Day three. I'm struggling to sleep. This raft is just rocking like crazy. Damn. Not gonna lie, I'm kind of miserable. Hopefully tomorrow's better. Day four. None of us managed to get any sleep. We lost the back of our fort last night. The house needs some repairs. Tensions are pretty high on the raft this morning. Nolan's a little upset. He broke his bed. Oh my God! Nolan is struggling. And he's just in his feels right now. It'll be okay. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> you probably would have quit the channel if I did that. This is easily the worst. Oh, there's thunder. I swear if it starts raining again. Oh, I can't take that. And to make matters worse, we accidentally dropped our ladle in the drinking water. And since we haven't showered in four days, grabbing it technically contaminated the drinking water. I'm never drinking out of that again. Oh, Damn. When we run out of water. Because of the contamination, a third of our water was no longer safe to drink. Damn. For whatever reason, the more I suffer, the more you guys watch. Some of our most popular videos are when I buried myself alive, spend time in solitary confinement. So I hope you're happy. I'm suffering again. It's not easy surviving on a raft, but after four long days, lasers finally pooping. <laughs> song song. Lasers finally pooping. Lasers finally pooping. Oh you know, shit! All those clouds over there are dark. Yeah, yeah, they're gonna pour down on us tonight. Look, chat. Gonna... All those... This right here, that's rain. This is rain. This. Over here, hold on, let me move my camera. Let me move myself so y'all can see. This over here, that's rain. It's up for these niggas. It's up for them. It's up for them. It's up for them. Pray for them. It's up for them. Clouds over there are dark. Yeah. Yeah, they're gonna pour down on us tonight. Tonight's gonna suck. We didn't know it yet, but the biggest storm of the entire challenge was heading right towards us. And when we saw it approaching, we tried to prepare as much as possible. Can't wait for another storm just to destroy all this again. Tariq is fixing his side of the fort and Chris is fixing the roof. And I'm now the cameraman for some reason. There's a storm of ruin. And while they're preparing the shelter for the storm, I'm gonna tell you guys about Shopify because it might literally storm until the end of the challenge. This is gonna be a bit rocky. Shopify is a platform that makes it easy for anyone to start a business. They literally support millions of small businesses all hey, with you know Shopify. What I'm it's actually getting pretty rocky out here. Hey, Bro, the wind is getting crazy. We're out of nails. It's really hard to work around the wind, guys. Ah! Stop yelling and do things. Shopify even has a new AI tool called Sidekick, making running your entire business easier. Just like surviving huh. on this rap can be hard, so can on. I want to skip the sponsor, but it's like there's video with. This is why I like how Mr. Beast does his sponsors. There's video within the sponsor. So it's like you skip and you might miss something because it's all tied in. It's not just, all right, here's, you know what I'm saying? Entrepreneurship. And that's why they do everything in their power to make it as easy as possible for you. This is my worst nightmare. So <laughs> miserable. Go to Shopify.com slash Mr. Beast to give it a try right now. Thank you, Shopify. Let's go prep for the storm. I'm soaking wet. Maybe you can start helping us, Jimmy. I was paid for the round. <laughs> this storm was really starting to pick up, but that night it got so much worse. This really puts the helter in shelter, eh? Ah! Oh, no! Dude! Oh, are you kidding me? It's leaking! Oh, no. This shelter is the opposite of waterproof. <laughs> this is brutal. What do we do? We have three ah! more nights of this. Next three Nolan. days, by the way. Ah! There's water everywhere. It's useless. This does nothing. This is the most insane night yet. Oh, no. Right now. Is this safe anymore? We would have just filmed this in a studio. But no, we have to be the real channel that does a fake thing. Oh, we're going to die. We're getting just destroyed. Oh, I'm getting hit. There's a hole that is completely opened up over my bed. I can't do it. I can't do it. You can end this video, Jimmy. You Jimmy, please. I tried to talk all you guys out of it. Okay. You all said yes. This is the <laughs> worst experience I've ever had in my entire life. I hate every part of this. Bro, I'm just miserable right now. Ah!
This storm was reaching a new peak with every passing hour. Jesus. We were desperate, so we tried using our beds as literal walls to protect us from the rain. We're all at rock bottom now. It's been Damn. raining for a few hours. Stuff's freezing cold. We don't have beds. I'm getting nauseous. What kind of... This bro, bro think he gonna edit? Stuff's freezing cold. We don't... Look, look at... <laughs> bro think he gonna edit? Mr. Beast done, you know what I'm saying? Stuff's yeah. freezing cold. We don't have beds. Uh, you know what I'm saying? I don't think he in the edit. This is the vid the edit was from? Yeah. <laughs> this nigga said, hold on, chat. It's been raining for a few hours. Stuff's freezing cold. He said. Mr. Briz is crazy. <laughs> I don't have beds. I'm getting nauseous. Yo, no. I don't know if we're going to make it this full seven days at this point. It rained nonstop for around 20 hours straight. 20 hours? And after standing the whole night completely soaked and exhausted, we had to push ourselves to dry off our supplies and rebuild camp. Our raft is just in shambles. Look at our beds. We're drying them off. This is harder than Antarctica. This is harder than a desert video. I'm just ready to be home. And I hate this rap. I never want to see it again. Our entire fire pit is completely drenched. We couldn't start a fire if we wanted to tonight. No dinner. And to make matters worse, all of our food was completely soaked, meaning only a portion of it was Damn. still safe to eat. We had stability. We had food. We had dry beds and we took it for granted. We cannot take another night like that. We need to waterproof the shelter. We just ripped that off. Tied it here, and then we'll need the airflow to the side. Damn. I mean, last night we were shivering cold and went to die. So would you rather be warm and dry or cold and wet? Put a zip tie here, Nolan. Tie a rope to that. Zip tie there. We can use that to push this up so we get even more room. I'm thinking, why don't I make a really big clothesline and hang up all our wet stuff? Maybe we'll have dry towels by tomorrow. I want to die. I'm sunburned, tired, dehydrated, and uh, I say tired. After fixing camp, we were so exhausted that we spent most of the day sleeping. But at least when we Jesus. woke up, we were reunited with a familiar friend. Brian. 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 After being stuck on a raft for five days with these guys. This really is a nightmare. <laughs> I'll admit it. I miss Brian. Brian, moved on. You may not have given up on Brian. <laughs> he but tried Brian so hard to you. get him back. Brian's given up on us. We have two days left. We're running out of food. Our water's contaminated. And we're all borderline dying. Ooh. I'm going crazy. These last two days will be interesting. Uh, Whoa, what could go wrong now? I can literally see 500 fish down there. That is crazy. Oh my gosh, this poop bucket stinks. I almost had a mental break last night. I was shivering. Wet the entire time, could not sleep. It was one of the worst nights of my life. Last night, shivering in the torrential rain in the Hell middle no. of the deep, dark ocean. You know, we got through it. Now the end of this challenge should not come soon enough. Making the challenge seven days was uh, a horrible decision. This yeah. is so much harder. You should have did like five days. The new reinforced waterproof fortress actually worked. Lennon said it rained last night, did it? Yeah, at 4 a.m. sprinkled a little hey, bit. Hey, here's the beauty. I didn't even know. That was the best sleep I've ever gotten. I actually got a full night's sleep last night. I can barely even open my eyeballs. I would say this <laughs> is the hardest challenge we've ever done. Adding the extra five days on the end of a 50-hour challenge definitely makes it harder. The Jesus. fact that we're just drifting at sea on this hunk of wood, that's pretty impressive. And while it seemed like the rain was over, we found ourselves encountering a new obstacle. We've gone from shivering cold like two nights ago to it being scorching hot, unbelievably hot. Damn. I'm about to jump in the water because I'm getting too hot. We're gonna go swimming. I hope Nolan can swim. And while they cooled off in their own way, we got creative with ours. Oh uh, yeah, it's bad. Oh, there. I feel amazing. Yeah. <laughs> a jellyfish hit me. No, no, oh, no. shit. Why does the ocean hate us? I knew Damn. it was a great idea not to go swimming. Damn. Are you okay? Oh, my leg. Oh, I found the sweet spot. 
Oh, yeah. Damn! Oh, no. Yeah, I got a little welts and some red lines. For the majority of the day, it was so hot. We literally couldn't walk on the deck. Yeah, I'm hot, hot. I don't want to be alive. Yeah. Hot. <laughs> it's very hot. But as the sun went down, we were optimistic about reaching the finish line. We have less than 24 hours left in the challenge. This has genuinely been the hardest challenge video I've ever been a part of. Honestly, this whole experience has made me appreciate all the things we take for granted in life, like your shower, your food. I miss Food. A working toilet. I never want to poo in a bucket again. <laughs> I say we celebrate making it this far with the Feastable Bar. Yes, it's available in every Walmart, Target, 7-Eleven, Albertsons, and America. In 2023, if you're still buying Hershey's, it's kind of lame. Hershey's for the boomers. Oh, oh shit. Jimmy. Why is my chair is just broke? Happening? Jimmy, I'm starting to think you ate all the food. Yeah, I guess I'll just continue the time lapse with a broken chair, I guess. Hey, I ain't gonna lie. Just imagine the conversations that was held out there, though. You feel me? Like, I feel like there was some real deep-ass conversations. How were they not dehydrated? They still had a bucket of water. Like, a big old barrel of water, actually. So, but I imagine the conversations that was had out that motherfucker. Boy, what I would give to be a fucking fly on the raft, bro. Just to not... Bro, I know there was... There was there was a like some deep shit, some YouTube shit like that would never be like spread between you know what I'm saying? I feel like it was some some real good shit there. This is our final night sleeping together, everybody. Ooh, I'm so hey, glad to sleep alone. I'm gonna miss sleeping by your side. 100 percent I would not rather sleep next to any other man. <laughs> <laughs> and with that, I'm going to bed. <laughs> Day six. Ugh. After an amazing night's sleep, we were visited by a familiar face. Brian brought his family to say goodbye to us on the last day. Thank you, Brian. That meant a lot. It's almost like we were family to Brian. We were. He kept us safe during our, like the night we had the least shelter. Maybe he's just a pea brain bird. <laughs> Shut up. Nolan, off the raft. I wish. That was emotional. Everything's gone full circle. We had so many crazy memories in this raft. Yep, and I think my best memory is gonna be leaving. <laughs> Same. We spent over 150 hours on this floating piece of wood. And even though it was easily the hardest thing I've ever done, the boys and I still had some good times. Where's this boat? Where's the boat? It's in the boat! Then finally, the end was literally in sight. The boat is coming! Alert the ship of our location. Signaling the boat! Why is it moving so abnormally slow? Oh my god! I'm getting off this round. The first 10,000 people to go to the shop app will get a free box of Feastables. Click the link in the description to download the shop app right now. Feastables!